Hello, this is The Finger Thing, and welcome to my first After Effects tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to effectively convert standard definition footage to high definition. Let me just import some footage. It's shot in 720x480 uh, 60i, and it's interlaced. So, we have this footage here, and it's at SD. We want to up it up to HD. Now, we are not going to just scale this thing up to look HD, like most people probably have done it. We are actually going to do something else after it. So what we want to do is go to the composition settings, and we are only going to change the width and the height of the composition. We are not going to change any of these other settings. So we are going to change it to 1280 by 720 and this is 720p. I'm going to choose OK and now as you can see SD is a little bit smaller than 720p. So what we want to do is right click on our footage on the timeline go to transform and oh it's off my screen you can't see it but it's something that says fit to comp and fit to comp so it'll basically scale this footage up to the composition now that we have this, what we want to do is take this composition here, bring it into a new composition. Make this a little bigger. And now our footage is being stretched. And you know what, really quick, let me interpret, uh, let me de interlace this um, by separating the lower fields first and preserving the edges. Okay, that's, I'm just de interlaced it because I don't really like those scan lines. So now, our footage is now scaled up to HD, but it doesn't really look very good. It's being stretched very slightly, but in order to sort of bring back some of the information, we are going to select the footage, go up to Effect, Blur and Sharpen, and choosing Sharpen. And this is an effect that will allow you to basically sharpen parts of your footage, as you can see and we're actually going to use this to sort of bring back some of the data. So we're going to try setting this to 10 and it sort of brings back some of the information. 15 and we'll see you can kind of see at a full screen here's what it looks like turned off turned on. You might be able to see a slight difference. I'm going to try 30 And that kind of brings it back. That might be a little too much. But we're going to set that to 25. So we are sort of starting to introduce some data to help it look like it actually is HD. So this is without it. I'm going to hit Command Shift H to hide the helpers. This is without it. And this is with it. It brings back some information, or it introduces some information. So as you can see, it looks really nice as if it were actually shot in HD and what we want to do is we are pretty much done but there's one thing that you can also apply and you can apply the curves adjustment color correction and uh, curves and you can do a slight color correction to help it just to enhance this a little bit more and I'm just gonna zoom in and we're gonna look at some of these closer areas here and if we take a look at it without any effects it kind of brightens it just a little bit so you if you want bring it down a little the effect this will sort of kind of give it that color that it was before it's very subtle uh, very subtle like very small but it does help with the footage out a little bit so that looks really good and there you go you have pretty much just converted this footage to HD so I'm gonna preview this by clicking the RAM preview button as you can see this footage looks very nice and it's so it doesn't look as stretched as it was before if you would just scale the footage up it actually looks very nice so again this uh, there are a lot of possibilities with this 
and let me put this back here. So again, uh, thanks for watching this tutorial and have a good day.